An explosive report tonight says BC's Oil and Gas Commission has been hiding evidence that hundreds of gas wells in BC could be contaminating groundwater. As Linda Aylesworth reports, critics are demanding a public inquiry. Liquefied natural gas, or LNG, is a touchy subject, as is the process used to extract it from rock underground, fracking. They are pushing immense amounts of water underground. They're also uh, pushing chemicals underground as well. But it's not what's going into the earth as much as what's coming out that has 17 health and environmental organizations calling on the province to hold a public inquiry on the fracking industry. At issue, a report by BC's Oil and Gas Commission. Well, the information in the report showed that uh, Oil and Gas Commission personnel visually confirmed gas leaking at 47 different gas wells in the north of the province. The report also found that as many as 900 other gas wells in northeastern BC might be leaking methane gas. But what's really got the signees fired up is the fact that the report, authored in 2013, only just came to their attention. I am deeply disturbed that information that was of vital uh, interest to the public was essentially withheld for four years and only turned up because somebody received a leaked copy of the report and started to ask questions. In response, the Oil and Gas Commission denied they suppressed the report, saying it was the result of due diligence to better understand the issue of gas migration, plan next steps for data gathering and potential mitigation efforts. You're not showing due diligence when you hold on to a report uh, on potential groundwater contamination. This is what happens when methane gas contaminates groundwater. What they want is more than the scientific review offered by the provincial government. If we have a wide open public inquiry where we have all sorts of people and experts able to ask questions in full, full public view, we will get the answers which we are entitled to. Linda Aylesworth, Global News.